Yo, babe. Got some mail. Yay, mail and mail. Do you know? Hey, nerdlings. Tom Stop. and Lacey here. Do you know the Variety Channel? We collect all kinds of things, and people know it, especially our nerdlings, because we got some mail from some of our friends. First up is the one, the only bandana gamer. You know, he's not all that active on YouTube anymore, but he is always active in our hearts. Believe it or not, it's John and Tom. We're blowing up your polo phone. Seriously though, this guy, he, he sends us stuff all the time. We uh, we gotta find something to send to him. If he would stop buying stuff for himself once in a while. I know, while. he asked, hey, will you look out for this? And then, hey guys, guess what I just bought? They better be like, thank Jesus, I'm friends with these guys. I mean. What is oh. it? What is it? All right, well, he sent a note, and it says, <coughs> nothing at all. I think that's trash. <laughs> well, Dork. he knows that we like our Doctor Who. Yes. He hooked us up with some series, complete series, of Doctor Who here. Nice. We got the Jodie Whittaker last couple of seasons, or serieses, as they like to call them overseas. So we've got the 11th, we've got the 12th, and then the 13th one. Now, this one... There was a bit of controversy with this one because the whole Flux storyline. Mm -hmm. If I remember, this is when they started to make some huge continuity changes. I mean, I don't think there's really any reason to go into detail. Just you ready for an unpopular opinion? Uh-oh. I hope they retcon this whole dang gum thing because oh. I hated it and it's stupid and it's not the Doctor and it's not the way the Doctor was actually going and it's totally out of character, so I hated it. Well, I was just <laughs> I was just avoiding spoilers for the storyline, but there you go. Hot, I didn't spoil anything. Right, right. Hot take. So now, now you've heard Lady Lace's opinion. Bring it. So <laughs> all the more reason for you to check it out. But yeah, let us know what you thought of the changes, uh, what you thought of Whitaker as the Doctor, what you think of Tennant as a return Doctor. Amazing. Hello, <laughs> he was my favorite Doctor. I know this teeth. Regardless of how you feel, though, I love collecting physical media. Yes. Because let's face it, uh, did anyone, <laughs> did anybody pay attention to the storyline of Sony getting rid of not only removing it from streaming services, but if you had already bought it and downloaded it, they were removing it from your hard drive. Oh, that yeah. doesn't seem right. Right? That seems so, a little shady. All the more reason yes. to collect physical media. Because unless Sony breaks into this house, oh my gosh, they're here! But regardless of how I felt about the very end, I am still a Whovian. I will always be a Whovian, so I am very excited to still to add these to the collection. <laughs> One last question on the Flux. Don't you have a Doctor Who Flux game, card game? Yes, I do. I knew it. Bandana knows us so well. <laughs> He is adding a couple of things to -da -da -da, the 1000 Zelda collection. Yeah, first of all, I don't think we've done the uh, the whole Lens of Truth. No, we haven't done that before. shirt yet. So. so here's another one Number. for the count. And he sent us a Japanese copy of Tears of the Kingdom. It's even sealed. Oh, so fun. Since, I can't read that. It's a shame because since I went ahead and played through the English Tears of the Kingdom, you get to play through the Japanese one. So good luck. You'll figure it out. No. <laughs> you just said what? I did not say what. I said you. That's what I'm asking you. And you is answering. Shut up. You. Yes. Not you, him. What's your name? Me. Yes, you. I am me. He's me. And I'm you. And I'm about to whoop your old ass, man, because I'm sick of playing games. You, me, everybody around here. Him. God, God, God. I'm going to kick his ass up. Check it in. Let me leave. No, leave. No. God, uh, are we going to keep this sealed? Oh, good question. Having played through it, there's no reason to open it, but it's us, so probably not. And is a Japanese? I'm warning you! It's gonna taste different than a not Japanese. <laughs> <laughs> no. Don't! Stop it! Let us know down below if it's already lost its seal. What do you guys think? And last but not least, a spoon. Spoon. What does it say? So this was one what of the pre-order bonuses that you could get for Tears of the Kingdom. Now that we have the sleeve, 
the oh. plaque, and, and the, the spoon. spoon. I believe that's all of the specialized pre-order pieces. I had no idea they did a spoon. That's random. That is so random. Why not like a set, like a fork, spoon, and knife or something? Or a spork or that's whatever. That's the uber extra super <laughs> deluxe. Like, you know, I'm like, I get the sleeve because he had a sleeve in the game, you know, tattoos. And the plaque because, you know, it's, you know, ancient looking. But a spoon? Like, did you run around the game with a spoon? All right, we got a pot lid. And a spoon. And a spoon. Time to show them who's... Too many cooks in the kitchen? It's time to... Who's boss? Whoa! He didn't even see it coming. Hold on. Did you oh, like... it was a sneak attack. Uh... I thought it was, like, maybe a super secret thing since you have the, the two dumbest weapons ever. Super? <laughs> That was so dumb. <laughs> That's the kind of dumb humor you can expect in the basement. <laughs> Monday through Friday, also on weekend. Thank you so much, yes, Bandana. Thank you very, very much, uh, you, you obviously enable art collecting with Doctor Who stuff and with Legend of Zelda stuff. It's been. So uh, hopefully we'll get to see you at a convention soon. It's been too long. I will bring you a Missouri spoon. <laughs> <laughs> okay, the next package is from our friends VKQ Interests and Adventures, uh, another fun family friendly variety channel. They probably do about as much stuff as us, you know, whether they're going to conventions and shows. And they sent a little something for us, so let's see what it is. There's a note. There is a note. Take notes, bandana. Oh, snap. Tom and Lacey, here are some Zelda Perlers that I made for you guys. 1000 Zelda Challenge. Merry Christmas, Tom and Lady Lacey. Love, Aww. Quinn. Thank you so much. That's so fun. They're also wrapped very nicely. Did oh, you see all this bubble I wrap? Did, so yeah. they weren't coming apart or busting or anything. Here's some bubble wrap for you. It's baby bubble wrap. Baby bubble wrap. <gasps> baby I bubble see wrap. Earrings. Go for it. That was the first thing that really caught your eye. Well, let me take off my big Christmas earrings. How adorable. Look at the little navvies. These are too cute. You had actually done a short showing off just some of your earrings, yeah. not even all of them. Well, that was all of my everyday earrings. It wasn't my holiday earrings. Those look great. They're so lightweight, too. It's like I don't, I can't even feel I have earrings on. Can you hear them? Hey, yeah. look. What? Listen. What was that? Tom should buy me more things. I totally agree, Navi. Did you hear her? I want it now. Well, here you go. Here's a rupee. It's a green rupee. It's worth one. Don't spend it all in one place, but buy yourself something nice. Hmm. We've got a couple of headless pearlers. Oh, no. How cute is that? Our Zelda people's heads are falling off. <laughs> now, they are two separate ones, so they do count. get their own count. <laughs> we had someone ask us if the Lego Zelda pieces are one piece or whole thing, like individual pieces. <laughs> We're like, that's cheating. <laughs> Hi, I'm Tom from Do You Nerd. You have the power of gold itself. The Triforce. Ba -da -da -da. And she stole the Triforce from me. The power of the gold in the palm of your hand. These are great. These are awesome. Thank you guys. These are yes, amazing. Yes, thank you so much. You did such a great you know, job. I didn't on even these ask. Too. Were these for me or for Tom? <laughs> <laughs> That's a whole another video. Watch Tom get his ears pierced by Lacey. <laughs> I'm not letting her anywhere near me with a needle. Hey, does. I got a sharp needle, a potato, and an ice cube. We're good. I think I'm going to try to attach some uh, magnets. Oh, that would be to amazing these. to make these. Magnets. That way we can put them up on on the door or on the, yes, the comic file awesome. tower. Yes. Because these need to be on display all yeah. the time. I I love how good these look. I always enjoy the pearler. I do. I so I fun. was very very into pearler for quite a while, and then I think I burnt myself out because I made like a really big one. But I used to love, it was very cathartic. I very much enjoyed Perler beads. They were very enjoyable, so. Well, thank you again, Quinn, and the rest of the VKQ crew for everything. Uh, obviously, all of your support and your friendship and the lovely Zelda yes, editions. Yes, thank you so much. And of course, Bandana, thank you so much. There will still be links in the description down below. Guys, leave some comments and make sure you go and tell Bandana, VKQ, how awesome of people they are for thinking of us. And I am going to wander off while you just, you know, let Navi 
tell you all the secrets. What? Because I've, I've heard enough of that one. Hey, look, Hi listen. Bye, darlings. Hey, look, listen. I am a microphone. You have got to check me. Hey, hey. <laughs> micro check, micro check. Hello, hello. Hang on. All right, there's Boba on my tooth. Hey, watch out. Watch out. Never mind, past, future, Tom, whoever you are. <laughs>